before we proceed with the quest, this is a great opportunity to bank for more food and prayer potions. You can return back to the island by talking to Dario, then speaking to Wadar. Then speaking to Lomdo. Same as before, turn on protect from range and get caught. As before, when opportunity strikes, exit. Now head all the way east to a very large building. And inside the building, on the east side, you'll find a trapdoor. Go ahead and climb down. Now it can get a little tricky as these large monkey guards get in the way and block your path. So just walk around and try to wiggle around them. Go ahead and use your bar on one of the flames and you'll obtain a monkey speak amulet. Just go ahead and string it. Exit the building and walk the northern side of the island like before. Just west of the jail, you're going to find an area with red ninja monkeys. Go ahead and walk exactly where I am. Now you're going to find a baby and an aunt monkey. Wear your monkey speak amulet. Now the plan is to talk to the baby, but you can't do that within sight of the aunt while she circles the building. So go ahead and speak to the baby once she's clearly out of sight. The first time you talk to him, press the fourth chat option. Then speak to him once again and choose the second chat option. He will now ask for quote unquote 20 bananas, but he can't count, so just give him 5. Once you've spoken to him for the third time, and the aunt has made at least one trip around, you're gonna receive the monkey Grigri toy. Now that you have the monkey talisman from the baby, Go ahead and talk to Zuknok, or Zook as we called him earlier. Yes, this is him underground, the lengthy path. Now, if you don't have the monkey bones yet, this is your last chance to obtain them. But if you handed them in earlier, you're just fine. Remember, the underground path that we have to take is found south of Apatol, not south of Crash Island, where the three gnomes are found on the beach. Once you reach the end, go ahead and give Zook the talisman. A cutscene will now appear. Go ahead and teleport to RD. This is also a very good chance to stock up on supplies. Head to the RD Zoo. Once within the walls of the zoo, equip the Grigri, then talk to the monkey minder. You will now be within the monkey cage. Go ahead and speak to any of the monkeys. Once he gets into your backpack, unequip the Grigri, and now you'll be booted from the cage. Now your job is to take this monkey to a patrol, but do not teleport. 
the monkey will escape your backpack if you do so. From the Artie Zoo, you'll have to walk to the Grand Tree. In the same way we got to Apatol before, speaking to Dario. Wadar. Then Lomdo. You will now have to talk to the gnome on the far east side of Apatol once again. This time it's a lot easier as you could just wield the monkey Grigri and have free access to the gate. Once you're at the gnome, speak to him. Make sure to speak to him in monkey form. Try entering the building right beside you, but you will be stopped by the guard. You will have to go ahead and talk to an NPC called Kruk, which is located way west of the island. Go ahead and just follow where I go. Climb up here. Climb up the ladder. Climb down. And speak to him. Go ahead and speak to the king twice. Once you've spoken to the king, speak to the gnome just outside. Speak to him once again. And you will obtain a 10th squad sigil. Now all you have left to do is to defeat the demon. So if you're equipped, go ahead and right click the sigil and click on teleport. Now finding the demon is pretty straightforward, there's no mechanics, just use protect from magic and defeat him. But once you defeated him, go ahead and speak to the king in the grand tree where we started the quest. Quest complete.